you're watching The Mail Room at Garden State Comic Fest. The Garden State Comic Fest came back to Marstown, New Jersey. Check it out. The Garden State Comic Fest in Marstown is a true comic and creator focused convention with guests and attendees participating from all over the world. Mmm, Comic Fest it is. The Fest is a great place to come out and meet the creators of some of your favorite comic books. Just at this last convention, Walter Simonson, Louise Simonson, and even Greg Hildebrandt was there. This is a great place to come and get those items signed by the creators. Looking for that hard to find issue? You'll probably find it at Garden State Comic Fest. Tons of comic vendors. Zap Comics, Gotham Underground, just to name a few. Gotta come check it out and pick up those comics you're looking for. I had the pleasure of meeting and chatting with Greg Hildebrandt, the original Star Wars poster artist. Talking about Star Wars, this little green guy was there too. That's right, Yoda. The cosplayers are awesome. Tons of photo ops all over the place and was even graced by the presence of Father Evil. Yep, wearing a Batman shirt, I run into the Joker. Besides comics, action figures abound at the fest. I've been coming to the fest for the past few years, and I really have to applaud Dave and Sal, the guys who started it, and continue to book great talent, great creators, and offer this fest to us here in the northern New Jersey area. It's a great fest to bring the entire family out to. Young kids, bring your grandma, bring your grandpa, because everybody will have a blast at Garden State Comic Fest. And like you see, photo ops abound, and I even got to meet YouTubers, Comic Pop, Sal and Tiffany, which I was excited to see them at the fest. These are some of the items I got signed, and uh, <laughs> you too can get your items signed. Come out next year to Garden State Comic Fest. Check out their website and have a blast. Mailroom in the news. July 2nd, 2019, The Walking Dead comic book has come to an end. The source of one of the most successful franchises in television history has come to an abrupt end. Creator Robert Kirkman made it clear at the end of issue 193 that he is ending the series after a 16-year run with no warning. The comics provided the basis and inspiration for AMC's long-running TV show of the same name, which is currently in its ninth season and has spawned two other shows. The end of the comic book raises questions about the future of the show. Although the AMC drama has never followed the comic book precisely and has rather offered its own takes on characters and storylines. Robert Kirkman says, this is the end of The Walking Dead. That's it. It's over. We're done. Robert Kirkman wrote in the final pages of the comic, which will be released this Wednesday. Robert Kirkman explained his rationale for the ending of the series without telling readers what to expect. I'm completely willing to bet some of you are angry over this, he wrote in a lengthy letter to fans at the end of the final issue. I get it. I do. I mean, why didn't we announce this so fans could prepare for the end? Well, personally, I hate knowing when the end is coming. Well, pick up this issue, read what Robert Kirkman had to say, but fans, you can start grieving because the Walking Dead comic has come to an end. Well, if fans are struggling what to read now, make sure you pick up the Immortal Hulk, 
great storyline, 18 issues so far and going strong. This is like John Carpenter's thing, meeting the Incredible Hulk. Pick up this issue, it's highly recommended by your friends here in the mailroom. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time from the mailroom.